Okay guys, this is some uh, very beginner stuff on how to make batch files. Okay, first of all you want to uh, open a new text document or just open notepad. And uh, first thing you want to type yeah. is uh, at echo off. What that basically does is uh, it, it hides your commands. So if you're typing in something like echo, like I mean like pause, it, it's, it's, if you have echo on it's going to show pause like like we're demonstrating now you don't have to follow any of this I'll show you this later all files so that's basically what it does so if we have echo on which is basically nothing yeah if you if you want to keep echo on you don't have to type anything if you're if you're looking for a more of a function out functional kind of thing and you want to see everything that it's doing Uh, this is echo on. It basically shows you everything that's going on in the batch file. <coughs> Whereas without echo off, it hides all of it. Okay, back back to this. Uh, add echo off. Okay, some basic commands are like shut down or basically to shut down your computer. Uh, you have options. Yep. Yeah. That's more of the uh so basically what dash s is is it it that means shut down so if you want to have it log off, you do dash l if it's rest rest restart I think it's dash r yeah. and so on and so forth uh dash t is basically the time that you want it, want to have it shut down like h how long before the shutdown in in seconds, so don't put it in minutes because if you put one minute, you're totally screwed. <laughs> And dash C is basically the comment that will appear in the shutdown m box little thing. Wait, you forgot. See that that's basically it. Uh time before shutdown. And mess you can set the message and stuff. I'm basically canceling that. Okay, so basically n now we're going to teach you how to cancel a shutdown with a batch file. Uh so s start uh shutdown dash A, sorry. Which means basically abort shutdown. Just shut down dash A. Okay, when when you are saving batch files, what you basically want to do is for the file extension on the end, put your file name, then put dot B A T and make sure you select all files when you're saving it or else we'll just save it as a normal text document I'm pretty sure and yeah that, that's basically what it does that's the uh, that's the can't abort shutdown and you just run the other batch file so I guess we're going to uh, go on to m menus or yeah. some very very small menus like loops I also do loops okay you want to set echo off and uh, make loop. You just type uh, colon loop. Name anything you want. You can make it like colon poo, like colon faggot or something like that. <laughs> or colon start. That, y that usually works for most advanced batch files. Okay, then you can do echo hello, echo y you're stupid, echo this is uh, this is a test. This is a test. <laughs> and then what you basically do at the end of that is go to start. And th what that basically does, it, it it loops it. Once it reaches the end of the commit, like once it goes through the batch file, it goes all the way back up start and does that again. So when you're running a batch file, don't think of it as a program. Think of it as a list of commands. So if you have a batch file with like six commands and no loop on it, all it's going to do is open, like run for like four seconds and then close. So it basically does things in a list. It's not like VB or like Java or anything like that. So there's no buttons. There's no anything. So here's the, the uh, see, uh, yeah. There's basically all the that, that's what the loop does. And so if you want to play around, I'm not responsible for any stuff. You can put shutdown in there dash s 
dash T 30 or 60. That works too. Not dash 60. Not dash 60. Yeah, just 60. Yeah. And then should we play around with that? I don't think we should play around with that. <laughs> uh, well, that what basically that what basically that does is all those shutdown menus that popped up before you'll get like unlimited <laughs> amount of those. You'll you'll, you'll get. Uh, you'll basically get a lot of those. So uh, look look for our next videos. Uh, see you guys next time.